no, but the it was like right on the edge, like it was about to go off, and it's the line's way that way, way that way. I think there's a fish on there. This tip up wasn't off, but it was right on the edge of going off. It's now spinning. It is? Yeah. I think there's a fish on here. Oh, you got a fish. I think there's a fish on here. Good thing I'm checking them. It's really starting to spin now. Yeah, I see it spinning. You might want to uh, get ready to get your... Yeah, we got a fish on here, folks. I got it. Oh, no, it Not very big. Might be a jumbo perch. Jumbo freaking perch. Holy cow. Dude, that, that is the biggest perch I've ever caught in this lake. Wow. That is insane. That's a big one. <laughs> I can grab him too if you want. That's the biggest pike I've seen on this particular lake. Right here. Woo! Nice. Yeah! Yeah! So Yeah! Yeah! Heck yeah! That is awesome. How come the perch That's a truck. Nice fish, yeah. man. <laughs> yeah. The perch. Yeah, the perch the weren't there. Weren't eating because he was that eating. Was Look at this. <laughs> size measure. What do you got? Look how Thirty-five inches. Thirty-five inches. Sweet as beef. Mine's a thirty-five inch fish. Yeah. Sweet. That beat my. Yeah. That beat my personal best. Yeah. Holy cow! Oh, He's fat too. Oh, He's coming through the hole. <laughs> yeah, give a good picture of him, buddy. At least of the pike. He's bleeding a little bit, but he was hooked in the mouth, so hopefully he'll be all right. Oh, oh yeah. Awesome. So <laughs> nice. Yeah. Nice fish, man. This tip up looks like something knocked it. See how it's right on the edge there? Yeah, here's a fish out here. Got one! Pike! I got a pike! Uh, nah. I don't know. <sighs> got him. Heck yeah. <laughs> Alright, ended the day on a decent fish. I don't know what happened. Somehow there must have been a tangle in this spool. I saw this thing was on like the edge of going off. And uh, the line was tangled up right there. That's why the flag never went off. <laughs> yep. You can let him go. Yeah, I got a picture of the perch. <laughs> nice. That's a fish. What is it? Rainbow. Rainbow. He's too big, I think, to pull up. I'm gonna have to run him down. Had a heavier line, I could probably pull him up, but. Oh, look how beautiful this fish is, guys. Pull him out for you real quick. Beautiful rainbow. Not too big. He's about, a, I don't know, probably just under 20 inches. All right. Let that fish go. Whew. Sweet. That's a decent start. We finally have a fish on. Uh, yeah. I can say I can do that or I can try and grab the fish. Got it. Okay. 
This is insane. Right in the mouth. Beautiful. Beautiful. That's what a pretty it fish. Is, oh man, that's what a pretty time. fish. It's been time. <laughs> We've been putting in the time. And uh, fun to get one on the board here. The release of Mr. Steel had big, beautiful male. He has the one lamprey mark, but still a pretty fish. All that worming and freaking squirming he was doing, trying to unhook him. There he goes. Alrighty. And it's off. Nice fish, man. That was... I'm glad I at least got one on film. The drive out here was officially worth it. Alright, so I'm definitely just grabbing my minnow. See, that's the fish taking it out right now. It might be the same thing running into your line. I don't know. Alright, guys. The gar is on the end of my line. I'm just going to let it eat for a while. The problem with these gars, they're just so hard to hook. You gotta wait till they really swallow it past the snout. I only got a 30 pound test leader, so get ready with that net because I don't have a steel leader on. It's still on there. Do you think it's been long enough? One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, Five Mississippi. There he is. Get him in the net as fast as you can. Nice, 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 nice. Thanks, Christian. Sweet, sweet, sweet. <laughs> Alrighty, folks. My first Western New York gar. Go figure. I actually tried catching one of these things for freaking ever in Western New York. And then I catch one in Florida to break the ice finally. And uh, now I catch one. I hooked him right in the mouth, too. Check that out. He might just be clamping down on it. Sweet. Yeah, I'm, I'm telling you, they hang sure. out in schools. That's, oh. your, is that your, that's not your first car. That's my first car in New York. <laughs> I bent the living crap out of that hook. Uh, do you mind getting my picture with it? And I'm going to release it. Got like these big bony plates on him. Alright buddy, back in you go. Oh. <laughs> He's got his head stuck in the net. I think I'm going to have to get him out of the net and just drop him. Yeah, his head's kind of stuck in the net. There he goes. <laughs> they got that long skinny head, so I put him in the net and he tries swimming away and his nose just got stuck in there. We finally got our pike. Either there, it's another bass. Oh no, it's a big smallmouth. Holy cow. It's the biggest smallmouth yet. Could be a largey too, actually. Don't do that under the kayak business. You know I don't like that. No, it's a big, small, big, small, biggie smalls here. Biggest small mouth yet. It's quite so hard. It's a big, long one. He's shaped like a freaking pike. <laughs> I'm gonna tie her out yet. You're not going under your branches. Oh, sir. No, sir. No, sir. There you are. Biggest one yet. They fight so hard in here. Gosh. Now he's catching river smallies, I guess. You know, in Florida, them peacock bass, they fight harder than the largemouth, but they're not in rivers. You know, they don't have them muscles that these suckers do. Yeah, we'll call him 18 and a half. His tail's kind of bent right there. So, you know, he goes to the 18. If we stretch him out, we can easily get another half an inch out of him. Yeah. We'll go 18 and a half. Yeah. He's chunky too. He could be four pounds. He could go four pounds when you're ready. Here he goes. Cool. Biggest one of the day. Finally got one that broke the 18 inch mark. Oh, 
Oh, there he is. You pick up the frog, he missed it again. Are you kidding me? There he goes. Didn't get it this time. We got him this time. Got him this time. A little bit bigger. Pickerel. Big pickerel. Big pickerel. A lot bigger pickerel. Don't bite through my line. Don't bite through my line. We gotta get him in fast before he bites through the line. Woo! That's a pickerel. <laughs> he bit through the line at the last second there. Look at that. Line bite for bit through. Woo, baby. There's my big old pickerel. That might be a PB. Hee <laughs> hee. Cool. 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 All right. Let's get our frog out of his gullet there. He choked it. Got the hit on film and everything. 23 and one half inches. New personal best. He's pretty scrawny though. <laughs> he says he's got a... It's got a stringer in his mouth? <laughs> I think I got him in the mouth. He's definitely got a stringer, all right. We'll help you. Cool man, this is your first real salmon, dude! Ah. Alright man, coming at you! He's too far away yet. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. Every time he gets near me, he gets another burst of energy. If I can grab this... Almost, I can almost grab the stringer. <laughs> I got him by the freaking stringer. It's in his mouth. <laughs> what the heck, dude? You caught a fish with a stringer in it. Oh, Gee. That, my line's wrapped all over him, dude. In I think mouth. you might just have the stringer. I got him in the mouth. It's it's definitely bringing him in by the mouth. I got him in the mouth, man. It's already on a stringer, too. <laughs> I'm so confused as to what happened there. I have no idea, dude. That is the wildest catch. That thing fought so hard considering it still oh has a stringer God. in its mouth. Whose freaking salmon was this? I have no idea. Alright, whoever got whoever salmon got away, it's ours now, I guess. That is absolutely like insane. In mouth, I just seen this yellow freaking string open. That is absolutely insane. I need a picture of this one. That's awesome. I'm glad I got this on film. That is the wildest salmon catch probably on film of the year. <laughs> what the heck, dude? He caught a salmon with a stringer in his mouth. <laughs> One swiped at it. Another one's looking at it. One's looking at it. I'm on. On. Careful if he turns and swims past you like so. Well, what do you want me to do? I whatever you think is best. If you can get him, he's right in the mouth. Oh, look out! Look out! Look out! Look out! I went over you. I went over you. These things, they have so much power, you think they're getting tired and they're not. He's coming towards you, he's coming towards you. Get him. These things fight so hard. Oh, he's right there, he's right there. No, look out, look out, look out.
Let him go. Don't fall, dude. Don't don't jeopardize your safety for the thing. If you, you gotta go head first. Yes. Awesome, man. Thanks. Holy cow! The thing wore us both out. Woo, baby. <laughs> That's PB. That's PB, Sam. Yeah. Look at that. 36. 30. 36 and a half. And a half. <laughs> yeah, dude, that's my PB freshwater fish. Yeah, man. That is my PB freshwater fish. Got him, baby, got him. Large man. Monster puppy. Monster puppy. Big old monster. Mondo large man. Look at that. How's that for a bass, ladies and gentlemen? How's that for a bass? Wow, that might be pushing my PB. That might be my PB New York fish. On a big, that's a big smallmouth. What? <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Looks like we got ourselves a big old bass. There's a big large mouth. No, it's a smallie. <laughs> cool. Well, big hit bass are hitting this time of year too, I suppose. Let's beach them over here, maybe. It's expecting a trout. I felt that thud. I was thinking trout and pike today. Was not thinking bass, but I'll take it. Check that out, folks. How's that for a chunker, McChunker? Ha, that's probably a Master Angler class fish. I guesstimate he's about 18 and a half. Nope, 18 and a half. I called it, baby. 18 and a half, another Master Angler class smallmouth on the year. I'll take it. We'll get a quick picture of him. Going this way. Get the beautiful background. We'll get one going this way too. Not what we were after, but we'll certainly take a Master Angler class smallmouth any day of the week, baby. There he goes. <laughs> There we go, on. There's my musky baby. Little guy. Either that or it's a big walleye. Might be a walleye. No, it's a musky. Little musky, or a pike. It's a pike. We'll see what it is. Yeah, it's a pike. <laughs> well, not what we wanted. Musky are actually more common than pike in this river. The fact that there's a pike hanging out there, though, means that there's probably not a muskie. Boy, look how he took that thing. He guzzled that X-Wrap. Alright, he's off. He's full of minnows, too. I guess he's gonna swim away on his own. <laughs> he swam away on his own. <laughs> Alright, well that's cool. We got ourselves a walleye. I think it's a big walleye. We're gonna find out, though. And that's not extended. Shoot. Is it in the net? It's in the net. Holy smokes, it's a giant walleye. <laughs> Alright. 
Well, that's not a bad way to end the night. Holy smokes! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Yikes! That's the size walleye I was after in Chautauqua. It's <laughs> a nice walleye for a small river. Wow! All right. All right. All right, we ended the night on a decent note. <laughs> Today has had its ups and downs, man. Let me tell you, it's probably a uh, 20 incher. I'm shaking, man. Man, it's been a while since I've had a fish that made me shake. I'm shaking. 23 looks like. Ah, 20. We'll call him 24. I'm at the zero. 23. 23. 23 inch walleye and fat. Is that a fatty pig or what? Yikes. All right. Cool. Well, we didn't get our walleye at Chautauqua Lake, but we did get a big crappie, and we got our nice big fat walleye at the Chattacoin freaking river. <laughs> Check that out, folks. Look at that Slaboroski. <laughs> Beautiful 23-inch walleye. I'll let you go to reproduce, buddy. How's that sound? There she goes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I was just about to leave, too. Get on biggest of the day. Oh, yeah. Biggest of the day, baby. He bit just like that stick did. <laughs> just brought it up and there's a fish on there. Yeah, we'll release this one. That's a trophy. That's a trophy. Get this one in the net. Well, I don't know if I'd quite say it's a trophy. I guess I consider a trophy walleye 30. My personal best is only 28. I'm yet to catch a true trophy. No, oh, no. Off of their stick. No, maybe it's 30. Boy, maybe he is a 30 incher. Holy smokes! Look at how fat that thing is! That is way bigger than I first thought. He's not 30. Huh. It's not even that big at all. The walleye I caught at the Chattacoin River was uh, almost the same length. Yeah, he's about 24 and a half. Yeah. 24 and a half, we'll call him. Nowhere near my PB. <laughs> nice, beautiful, very, very fat. 24 and a half inch walleye we're about to release here. And he's ready to go. Beautiful Allegheny River on a snowy morning. There we go. <laughs> Flatfish works, baby. <laughs> it did work after all. <laughs> they weren't biting it at first. I thought maybe they've been tormented enough, but... Small salmon. Might be a coho? We'll see what it is. One minute. Could be my coho. Coho, coho, coho. I've never caught a coho. Please be a coho. Whatever it is, it's mine. <laughs> yeah, baby. <laughs> now it's an old king. <laughs> Flatfish works, baby. <laughs> Making sure. I think I got the hit on film and everything for a change. Alrighty. Well, I'll let him go. And uh, these flatfish lures are allowed down here. Because uh, they are a floating lure. Again, that part of the reason why they're legal is it's actually really, really hard to snag fish on them because uh, the way they swim and the way they float really only usually catch them when the fish hit them. Oh. All right, let Mr. Zombie King go. See if uh, it looks like he pretty much doesn't have any eggs left. Otherwise, I'd milk it. This might be a male anyway. I don't really know how to tell the difference between males and females yet. The folks down there have on what looks like a nice brown. Looks like a real nice brown those folks have got. Oh yeah, beautiful brown trout. Cool. Well, stuff's happening. Got taken again. This looks like a freaking brown trout this time. Oh, I wish I got that head on film. I so wish I got that head on film. Oh, I wish I was recording when that thing hit. That was amazing. 
it was right near the surface of the water. That was a top water freaking hat. And I think this is a brown too. A brown on a flatfish? Hell yeah. On a freaking lure. Now nah, maybe it is another salmon. It's just a skinny one. I don't know what this is actually. I'm gonna stop pretending that I know what this fish is. <sighs> Could this be my coho? I want to catch a coho. I've never caught a coho. I know cohos are usually pretty aggressive. Come this way, baby. Come this way. I'm gonna try and get you on this side of the rock. And then I'll have you easy. I wish I had that head on film. That fish was so freaking aggressive. It looks like it's a freaking really dead brown. <laughs> it's a really ugly freaking brown. <laughs> I can't believe a brown hit the flatfish. Watching the water over here. Dude. Or is that a coho? I don't know my fish species. This might be my first ever coho. It's not a king. Thank God I brought the quick fish today. Holy cow. Alright, he's about two feet. His tail's a little bent, so I'm going to give him another inch. So I'm going to call him 25. 25, I think that this is my first ever coho. I don't know what this is, though. <laughs> Alright, let him go. Fishing spoon slow, targeting big breeder trout and pike. I, I have had big smallmouth at this time of year, too. So it's possible we could hook into a big bass as well. Odds are we're not going to catch anything, but like I was just telling Dustin, if we do catch a fish up here at the lake, it's probably going to be something decent. So that's the trade-off, you know. Low probability of catching something, but um, if we catch something... Oh my gosh, I'm on! Or is that a snag? No, I'm on, dude. I'm on. Get the net, get the net, get the net, get the net. Holy crap, I got the hook set on film and everything. Holy crap, dude. Yeah. Come on, this side of the dock. Hook set on film and everything. Big, big freaking trout or pike. I, I don't know what it is. It's either a big trout or a big pike. Yeah! It's a big freaking trout, baby! Heck yeah! Heck yeah! Get this fish, Dustin. This is my big fish of the my big trout of the year. Yes! 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 Holy crap! Dude, that thing is huge! Holy crap, PB Brown Trout, baby! Hook set on film! Heck yeah! Woo! Woo! What now? <laughs> oh man, dude, my adrenaline is pounding. Justin, that's my biggest brown trout ever. I'm calling him 25. Look at that. That goes to 25. 25. 25 inches, baby! Personal best brown trout! Heck yeah! Okay guys, releasing my biggest ever, 25, 25 inch freaking brown trout. <laughs> releasing for somebody else to catch. Hopefully you can catch them under the ice. High five man. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm glad we made the decision to take some casts up here. Yeah. Dude, that is amazing. Great picture man. Thank you. Freaking awesome. Freaking awesome! <laughs>